Tell you, sucker. Here come the motherfucking lies again. These, you know what I'm saying? These satanists come back just motherfucking them. Can't stop the fucking lies. Let me tell you something, people. You, when you see a publicity stunt, you know a publicity stunt. I mean, I can spot a publicity stunt from a motherfucking mile away. Now, you all know the Kardashians, you know, whether it be Kylie Jenner, whether it be Kim Kardashian, Khloe Kardashian, you know what I'm saying? All the motherfucker Kardashians, they are natural born media outlets. The Kardashians are like what Oprah used to be. You know what you know what Oprah, right? You know, you know what I'm saying? Anybody you know what I'm saying? if you wanted to be famous, if you wanted to sell your book and become a, a, a New York Times bestseller, just have Oprah feature your book. Have Oprah talk about your book as an instant success. You know, back in the day everybody who went on the Oprah show became an instant success. Well, you know what I'm saying? The Kardashians is what Oprah used to be back in the early two thousands. They are the new Oprah. Kardashians are the new Oprah. If you want to be famous, you have to do rituals and, you know what I'm saying, and be ordained by the Kardashians, and the Kardashians will make you a big damn success. They they did it with damn Jordan Woods, didn't they? Jordan Woods was supposed to be, I think, was it Chloe's um, or Kylie's uh, best friend? And you know what I'm saying? And something happened with uh, Jordan Woods and and uh, 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 Tristan Thompson. The next thing you know, Jordan Woods is out and she's a big success. She got her own platform. That was a publicity stunt, you know that? Now, this right here. Motherfucking am. Saquon, yes, yeah, Saquon Berkeley, an uh, NFL star for the, uh, he's a running back for the freaking Giants, uh, NFL star, and it says that he was caught out at a popular Hollywood, West Hollywood diner with Kylie Jenner's best friend. Now, nobody knows who the fuck this bitch is. Now, I don't know who the fuck this bitch is. Nobody knows who this guy And number one, I thought motherfucking them Jordan Woods was Kylie's best friend. How many best friends you got, bitch? I'm going to ask you brothers and sisters out there. How many motherfucking best friends do you have? Do you have 10 or 20 best friends? Or do you have one best friend? Some of you motherfuckers only have, don't even have no best friends. But motherfucking Kylie Jenner is the only motherfucker I know that got more than one best friend. Because last time I checked, Jordan Woods was her best friend. Now she got another best friend. You know what I'm saying? After this best friend, is going to be another best friend. But it says, freaking damn Kylie Jenner's best friend was spotted out with this NFL star. Now nobody knows Kylie Jenner's best friend. You know what I'm saying? But now, everybody knows Kylie Jenner's best friend. Publicity stunt complete. Bringing her more into the spotlight. I wonder what rituals this best motherfucking friend done did to get this type of publicity. Because let me tell you something. If you are an NFL star, you are a public figure. You're famous. So, it is not wise to be with somebody that you don't want to be spotted with in a hot spot. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to put it like this. If I sit here all day long, preach against these satanic scumbags in Hollywood, and you see me with Kylie Jenner in Times Square... Just hanging with Ch- Ch- Kylie Jenner in Times Square. 
I'm asking for it. I'm looking to be seen because I'm in Times Square with Kylie Jenner, a known personality, Pastor Michael Smith, who's known for going hard at these satanic scumbags in Hollywood. Is with the main satanic scumbag, Kylie Jenner, in a popular spot like Times Square. Am I looking for attention? Yes, I am. So I said that to say this. Motherfucking damn, they was looking for attention. Because if you wanted to be on a creep creep, you will be in a back in the woods spot that nobody knows about. You will order out to eat. Or something like that. Uber Eats and shit like that. But no. You wanted to be seen. This was all staged and all planned for this to be seen. To bring so-called Kylie Jenner's motherfucking best friend into the spotlight. The same way Jordan Woods was brought into the spotlight. So this makes two best friends. That the Kardashians that made stars. The Kardashians made Jordan Woods a star. Now the Kardashians is making this bitch that nobody heard of a star. And they making it look like, oh, it was an accident. Oh, you know what I'm saying? So now, motherfucking them, this NFL player, Mr. Jaquan or Shaquan, motherfucking them Berkeley, even though he have a baby's mama, and his baby's mama is his girlfriend, now it's going to be beef between this boy's baby's mama and this motherfucking them Kylie Jenner's motherfucking them uh, uh, best friend. You know what that's going to be? You know what I'm saying? That's going to be the talk of the town. Now, these two jackasses can be on motherfucking them, their own reality show. Or this, these two women can motherfucking them be on the Kardashian show. Nevertheless, hell, they can start their own podcast now. You know what I'm saying? Now they got some fire. People who like drama. And this is the drama, all the drama they need. Now people want to know what's coming up next. Oh, we want to hear what her baby's mother got to say about him going out with this chick. You see how that works? There's something more bigger, sinister, in play. And they all in cahoots. It's a fucking publicity stunt. But anyway. This is news. I want to thank you all for tuning in and logging on to another episode of Illuminati News Hour right here on Gospel Talk Radio. I'm your host, I'm your pastor, Mr. Michael Smith. If you are new to this channel, please tap that subscribe button. Hit that like button if you like this show. Hit that hate button if you hate this show. Hit that comment below, leave a question or comment on this show. Also, don't forget, uh, check out um, Sister Camilla Bates' brand new track. Off her debut album called I Am God's Greatest Creation. Available on iTunes right now. Go ahead and download it. Click on the don't click on the um her website link in the description box of this show. Camilla Bates dot com. K E R M A L A B A T E S dot com. Also, our weekly podcast show every Friday night at 9 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time, uh, www.illuminatiexposedmedia.com. The link is in script, both links in the description box below. Till next time, stay tuned. God bless you. Worship is holy.